when I move on from Manchester, which I think I will, I'm ready to do, because I'm in my 30s and I came here in my mid-20s because of the clubbing and the partying scene. And as I've got older, I've become quite spiritual and I've quite um, got into Buddhism here. And I think in Manchester, there's that many different places that you can go to meditate and feel Buddhist, that it's quite nice that I've been here and I've been able to access that quite readily, which in other places you can't. So it's like spiritually, I've really, really grown here. And for me, church is really important. So I was just showing Sunita where I go to church in Rush Home. It's at Platfields Church. And it's just amazing that you can land in a city, go to your local church, and then immediately you've met a whole community cross-section of people I I just love it absolutely love it and so I've got a Malawian friend who I live with and she's just loving cooking her beautiful food and we're kind of <laughs> and around the corner I've got a Sudanese friend who's going to come around and cook for us and we're cooking for them it's, I just love the difference I just love the difference and I moved to Manchester took my first job here and I just felt there were less barriers um, probably because it's more of a mixed community. So as a woman here, I think I'm, in my career and in my personal and spiritual life, I've developed to the point where I don't know if I would have developed that much elsewhere or back in the South, I don't think it would have happened. But here, I think you feel more accepted um, and just more, it's a norm, isn't it? Like there's a lot of strong women that we've met, especially in the area that we work. I'm just thinking of all the people I met when I did my social work masters course and what they've gone on to do, one of them is managing a refuge for women who suffer domestic violence and you see how many of these women, educated women, are going on to have massive impact on change for good and it's pretty amazing. And basically I think it's about if you have self-belief and you realise that you can fulfil your potential, everybody has gifts, they just need to believe in themselves and go for that. I'd like to be a lawyer. <laughs> yeah. Well, because <laughs> I'm good at arguments and debates. <laughs> the world that's what I want to do everywhere like a world tour I think that'd be great with my friend oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I've lived there for like all my life I've never been abroad so I think university after university I think I'm a moving but it's my hometown so I still be here all coming the time. Back. yeah <laughs> yeah we're yeah. fitting the same yeah we just want to explore and go see other places yeah Wives, you know, all really nice and ladies of a life. For the sisters, the friends and the wives, yo. This is for the women in our lives. For the sisters, the friends and the wives. This is for the women in our lives, yo. For the sisters, the friends and the wives. This is for the women in our lives. For the sisters, the friends and the wives, yo. Spy, for the give women. us some vibes. Foot, foot, for the women. Foot, foot, the, but for the women. The girls and the women. The grannies, the ladies, the women. The, the opposite to gentlemen. For the women, the women of the world. That goes out to my daughter, my little four-year-old girl.